We were in the middle of a test drive and I pulled into this parking lot here to walk around this old money. It's got a 350 under the hood. It's a 1970 model. And it does run and drive pretty good. Check us out at maplemotors.com. We're in Hendersonville, Tennessee. You can see about, I don't know, 1900 videos or so on here of different cars that we've test drove and walked around. I have finance options and I have shipping. I could ship this car anywhere in the country. So hit subscribe, hit like, and if you don't mind, share this video. Let's get started. So this one here has got, uh, looks like power steering under the hood. Uh, AC is not hooked up and it won't be working if it's not hooked up. We're gonna run along the lower portion of this car looking for flaws. It's a little chip right there. Coming up over the fender. Looks like a light, light scratch. That will buff out. Long down. Picked up some dirt from the road. Got some little spots right there in the trim. Got some little specks right here on the trim as well. Coming down the mid section, they got a crack right here. Pretty straight on the down the side of that car. That looks good. I love this color. Got a chip in the corner there. The front grill's looking really nice. Along with the bumper, it's been replaced. It's nice and clean. A little wax below the light here. A couple little bug splatters. Let's go around the top of the fender here. Come on down. Front windshield's in pretty good shape. I don't see any chips. Trim looks good. Your door handle here's got a little bit of pitting on it. Looking across the roof. In good shape. Dun, 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 dun. Aerosmith's in the tape player, by the way. I was jamming it hardcore when I was making those drive videos. <laughs> Look at the tips on this one. Those look good. Trunks had nice carpet in it, nice speakers, package tray. Looks pretty good. Got an amp sitting in there. The jack, the spare, CD player, that's what I'm talking about. Weather stripping looks good, jams are clean. Make sure my keys are up there. Wouldn't that be a terrible thing, lock the keys in the trunk? Maybe they're in my pocket. Oh yeah, I got them. Oh yeah, let's shut the trunk. Trunk shut's good. Lines up well. A little dirt there. But I really like this paint job. Beautiful color. Bumper on the back's nice and clean. Let's run down this side. Look how straight that car is. Coming on down. You got a few little scratches in the corner there. A chip right here. Dun, 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 dun. Hit in the trim there. Another small one in the trim there. Lots of little road chips on the trim there. <laughs> on the corner, some wax. Touch up marks on the inside of the door. Touch up mark right there as well. Extra wax. There's always wax on these cars. Everybody's always polishing on them. Bit of rust there inside that trim, or that clip clips in. More wax in the corner. We're running down the fender here. It's looking pretty good. I'll stop when I see something, by the way. I usually tell you that. I kind of rush around if it's just nice and clean like the middle of the store. There's no reason to stop. 
but you do got uh, light scratches up here they will buff out they're there though pitting on your mirror that mirror has got all kinds of stuff looks like space it's got a lot of pitting popping up trim it's good that's coming off it's coming off. a little crack here on your pillar Okay, pitting on your door handle. Let's look inside this ride. As soon as I step inside, the interior looks great. Seat's in good condition. It's not all ripped up. Same with the back seat, package tray. Headliner needs to be stretched out in the corner, but other than that, it still looks great. Oh yeah, I got the keys in my pocket. There we are. Starts up good. Go ahead and place your bets. Do you think the horn works? Let's try now. <laughs> Did that in a hurry, didn't it? Works good. Blower motor is not working perfectly. It's uh, not working at all, hardly. I can hear it kicking on and off, but it's just not blowing. Showing 75,000 miles on this 1970 Monte Carlo. It is hard to prove that. Yeah, radio's jamming. Windshield wipers wiping. Do, 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 do. Clock's not working on this one. Speakers in the kick panels. Door panel is in great shape. As we're on our way out, we'll check that. You got some nice older weather, weather stripping coming around. It's still okay though. It's nice and squishy, so. Corner of that door has got a little bit of cracking going on. Let's look at the bottom. Okay. She's nice and quiet. Pull down on the hood here. It shuts nice and easy. In the front, there's a couple chips. You got some light scratches right here on top. close to 100 detailed pictures of this ride and every ride at maple motors just go to maplemotors.com that's my main website here on youtube you'll see test drives and walk arounds of each individual car you can also see full lot walks update that every monday along with that website you can get financed and shipping information at maplemotors.com let me say it again maplemotors.com i appreciate you watching hit subscribe if you haven't already you can also hit the notification bell to let you know every time I post a car. One last thing before I leave, I will show you the undercarriage. Check out the test drive to see more undercarriage shots with lights that light up the undercarriage when I drive over the top of them. Let's look.
want better undercarriage photos, they're on the website, they're on the test drive. Please share this video and hit like. I'm gonna go back to the lot and grab us another car. We're gonna finish up this test drive on a Monte Carlo. See you later, guys.